Tonight's officials have communicated with the head coaches and captains of both teams on the subject of the Kentucky High School Athletic Association sportsmanship policy, which reads, the Kentucky High School Athletic Association requires officials to enforce sportsmanship rules for athletes and coaches. We will not tolerate negative statements or actions between opposing players, especially trash talking, taunting, or baiting of opponents. If such comments are heard or actions seen, a penalty will be assessed immediately. We have been instructed not to issue warnings. Let tonight's contest reflect mutual respect. Softball fans, tonight's umpires are from the 5th Region Officials Association. In the field is Brandon Turner and behind the plate, Keith Creech. Leading off, playing right field, the senior, number 11, Kiara Atkinson. Batting second, playing left field, she's a junior, number 7, Kendra Gaddy. Batting third, playing third, third base, a junior, number 4, Chloe Cox. Batting fourth, and playing first base, she's a senior, number 13, Reese Carwell. Batting fifth and pitching, a junior, number 16, Grayson Mattingly. Batting sixth and catching, a sophomore, number 24, Abby Milligan. Batting seventh, playing second base, she's a junior, number three, Tori Griffin. Batting eighth, the designated player, a sophomore, number 22, Claire Biddingfield. Batting ninth, playing shortstop, she's a... Ladies and gentlemen, at this time we ask that you please stand and gentlemen remove your hats for the playing of our national anthem.
All right, folks, here we are at Tally Field, Grandparents Night here. Uh, home game against the Adair County Lady Indians. Go through the defense as they come out. I can pretty much tell you where they're going to be, but we'll let them decide for themselves. On a special note, here it is, Grandparents Day. Number 16, Grayson Mattingly has a very special grandparent at home, Miss Judy. She calls her grandma. Judy Mattingly, we're glad that you're out there watching your baby girl pitch for the Lady Knights. Behind the plate, number 24, Abby Million. At third base, number four, Chloe Cox, the shortstop. Number one, Kendall Thompson. At second base, number three, Tori Gribbins. First base, the senior. Number 13, Reese Caldwell. In the circle, number 16, Grayson Mattingly. Left field, number seven, Kendra Gaddy in center field, the senior, double zero, Maggie Benningfield. And in right field, the senior, number 11, Kiara Adkinson. We'll be back here in just a minute. All right, folks, here we go. Game time. Only the second home game for the Lady Knights this season. Get up here in the top so I can see what's going on. All right. Swing and a miss. First pitch. The 0 1 count. I'd like to thank all the grandparents for coming out and participating in Grandparents Night here at Tally Field. And another swing and a miss, 0-2 the count. Strike three. The strikeout for the junior, Grayson Mattingly. Now batting, just... Swing and a miss. Oh, and one the count. Ball one misses high. One ball, one strike. One ball, one strike. Foul ball. One and two the count. Lady Knights 1-0 on the series this season between themselves. Swing and a miss. That's the second strikeout for Mattingly. 1-0. The, now the series one. goes to Marion County so far. 13-1 win over the Adair County Indians on their last meeting right here at Tally Field. Two down in the top of the first. Swing and a miss. Oh, one count. Swing and a miss again. Oh, two. Maybe a one, two, three.
And another foul ball. One ball, two strikes. Strike three, three up, three down for the Lady Knights. We're going to the bottom of the first with no hits. the bottom of the first for the Lady Knights. Number 11, Kiera Atkinson. Leading off in the bottom of the first for the Lady Knights, number 11, Kiera Atkinson. Bow -bow. Oh, and one the count. Foul two. In the next circle, the left fielder, number seven, Kendra Gaddy. Swing and a miss on the off speed. It gets Kiera Adkinson swinging. Brings up number seven, the left fielder, the junior, Kendra Gaddy. In the on deck Kendra circle, left fielder, the Gaddy. junior, number four, Chloe Cox. Strike called on the outside, 0 1 the count. Chopped to the pitcher, the one three put out. Brings up third baseman number four, Chloe Cox. In the on next circle, the senior, number 13, Reese Caldwell. It's a chopper, a slow roller over to third base. Out at third base. Three up, three down for the Lady Indians. First base, sorry, I said third. In the bottom of the first lane, I scored no runs on no hits. 
Do up for the Lady Indians in the top of the second. Wall, Cheatham, Campbell. I just shared it to my Facebook page, the YouTube. It's on there now. All right, folks, sorry for that. Uh, Facebook was down for just a minute, but I fixed it now. You can go to the Million Sports Network page uh, to see the game also on the YouTube. Swing and a miss. All right, let's go through the defense. Behind the plate, number 24, Abby Million. At third base, number four, Chloe Cox, the shortstop, number one. Kendall Thompson at second base, number three, Tori Gribbins. First base, number 13, Reese Caldwell. In the circle, number 16, Grayson Mattingly. Strike called across the middle of the plate. 0-1 oh, the count. In left field, number seven, Kendra Gaddy. Center field, double zero, Maggie Benningfield. In right field, number 11, Kiara Atkinson. Top of the second, no score here. Swing and a miss, 0-2 oh, count, one out. Strike three gets her looking on the outside quarter. Now batting number 33, Allie Campbell. Ball one misses outside. 1 0 count. Ball two misses high. 2 0 count to Grayson Mattingly. Again, we'd like to thank all the grandparents who participated in Grandparents Night tonight here at Tally Field. We have a couple of other uh, fun nights in store for the season. Strike two, one, crosses the middle of the plate. We have a military appreciation night. We have a uh, inclusion night, and we have a little league night coming up. So make sure you follow us or just meet us here at the field for a better time. Hard shot at Kendall Thompson, the 6-3 put out. Records the third out of the top. Be back here in just a minute, folks, with the, the batting lineup. Do up Thompson. Do up Caldwell. Caldwell, Mattingly, Million. Mattingly and Million.
Leading off the senior, the first baseman, number 13, Reese Caldwell. First pitch is going to get her out at first base. Off the knob of the bat, it looked like. Next up for the Lady Knights. The pitcher, number 16, Grayson Mattingly. Mattingly. I'd like to thank Daniel Johnson, our MC for the evening. Been doing a great job up in the box. Foul ball. In the next circle, number 24, the catcher, Abby Million. Ball one misses high and away. One ball, one strike. Ball two misses high and away. Two balls, one strike. Strike called on the inside. Two balls and two strikes. Double. Ball. Come on. Two and two the count to Grayson Mattingly. Ooh, ball three brings up a full count. Three balls, two strikes. Uh oh, foul ball. Nice hard hit. Wind didn't carry it far enough. Off the end of the bat, foul ball. Still no score here in the game. It's the bottom of the second. There you go. Down the third baseline will be a single. For number 16, the pitcher, Grayson Mattingly, brings up the catcher. Number 24, Abby Definitely Million. For the Lady Knights. Number 24, Abby Million. Uh, we'll have a courtesy runner for the pitcher. Number 20, Kenley Craig. We'll assume first base for the pitcher. Number 16, Grayson Mattingly with the first hit of the game. Courtesy running for the Lady Knights. Number 20, Kenley Craig. Ball one misses high, 1-0 -oh count.
Kenley Craig steals second base. Nice job by Craig. Ball falls out of the glove of the shortstop. Two and oh count two million. Ball three misses high away. Three oh count. Ball. <laughs> Three balls, one strike. Ball four puts Million on first base. Two runners on for the second baseman, the junior. Number three, Tory. Gribbons. Now batting for the Lady Knights, number three, Tori Gribbins. In the on deck circle, the sophomore, number 22, Claire Benningfield. Uh oh. It's going to be a three run shot. For the junior, number three, Tory Gribbins. Nice shot by the uh, junior number three, Tory Gribbon, center field. Home run. Puts three runs on the board now for the Lady Knights. Knights. Number 22, Claire Biddingfield. And, the, and to the box for the Lady Knights. Number 22, Claire Benningfield. In the on deck circle, the shortstop. Number one, Kendall Thompson. Ball one misses high. 1 0 count. Ball two, misses high and inside. Swing and a miss, two balls, one strike. That's a shot right to the second baseman for the out at first. The 4 3 put out puts the second out on the board for the Lady Knights. Brings up the shortstop, number one, Kendall Thompson. In the on deck circle, Next top of the order, the Knights, number, number one, 11, Kiera Atkinson. Ball one misses inside, 1-0 -oh count. Swing and a miss, one ball, one strike. Swing and a miss. Come on, Kendo. One ball, two strikes. Ball two misses high. Two and two the count. A little bit of softball bingo here tonight at Tally Field. Been a couple people already. Everybody should have, but some people have already got the bingo. The off speed misses inside. Full count. There 
And a shot at the second baseman, the 4-3 put out. Ends the inning, but first, we'll record the three runs from Tory Gribbins' center field home run. Puts the Lady Knights on top. 3-0 going into the top of the third. The Lady Knights score three runs on two hits. Two up for the Lady Indians in the top of the third. White, Brown, Riley. Defensive positions for the Lady Knights. Popped up into right field. Tracked down by number three, Tori Gribben. Now batting number 21, Brown. Swing and a miss on the rise. Oh, and two the king. Slow roller, two gribbons. The 4 3 put out records the second out. Now batting number 23, Riley. Strike crosses the outside corner, 0-1 the count. Now batting, Strike two, crosses inside, 0-2 count. Swing and a miss. Another strikeout for Mattingly after two and a half. Lady Knights on top, 3-0.
Audio issues, folks. Sorry, number seven, Kendra Gaddy, the left fielder, stepping into the box. Strike one, crosses inside. Oh, and one the count. Ball one inside, one ball, one strike. Ball two outside, just a bit low. Two one count to Kendra Gaddy. In the on deck circle, the third baseman number four, Chloe Cox. Double. Two balls, two strikes. Off the end of the bat, slow roller to the third baseman will be safe at first base. Throw is just a half a second late. Lady Knights, number four, Chloe. Cox. Chloe Cox, the batter in the on next circle, number 13, Reese Caldwell. Cox 0 and 1 on the game. Strike one crosses. Oh, one count. Swing and a miss. Oh, two count to Chloe Cox. We'll take it. Hit by the pitch. Cox takes one. Puts her on first base, brings up the senior. Number 13, now, Reese the Knights, Caldwell 15, in the on deck circle. The pitcher, number 16, Grayson Mattingly. Ball one misses low, 1-0 count. Chloe Cox on first, Kendra Gaddy on second base. 1-0 count to Caldwell. Ball two misses outside. Commanding lead by Gaddy on second, makes her way back. No contest from the catcher. Foul ball. Two balls, one strike. Strike two crosses low. A little bit low and inside. Ball three hops across the plate. Full count. Uh oh, into left center field. A one hopper via one RBI single. 
turned into a double for Reese Caldwell. Smart base running for Caldwell. Now for the Lady Knights, number 16, Grayson Mattingly. Brings up the pitcher, number 16, Grayson Mattingly. Bravo. <laughs> oh, one count. <laughs> Shout out to Judy, Grandma Mattingly at home watching. Bow ball. Owen to the count. <laughs> Off the end of the bat will be a sacrifice. Call that a sack butt. Why not? Puts a run on the board for the Lady Knights. Advancing Caldwell to the third base. The Lady Knights, number 24, Abby Million. Brings up Million. Million with a walk on her last at bat. Ball one misses high. 1 0 -oh count. The ace. An RBI double for number 24, Abby Million. Now coming to the plate for the Lady Knights, number three, Tori Gribbins. In the box, number three, the second baseman, Tori Gribbins, with a three run shot over center field on her last at bat. First three runs of the game came from Gribbins. Million on second base. Ball one misses. Just a bit inside, 1 0 -oh count. Ball two misses high. Two balls, one strike. In the on deck circle, number 22, Claire Biddingfield. Ball three, misses low. Three and one, the count. That's a shot. Just left of the second baseman will be an RBI single, bringing Million across the plate. Puts another one on the board for the Lady Knights. Gribbins two for two on the game. Four runs for Gribbins here today. Swing and a miss. Oh, one count. It is. I just want to talk to you for a minute. It's too early. 
Ball one misses high. One ball, one strike. In the on-deck circle, number one, Kendall Thompson, the shortstop. Ball two inside. Ball two inside and low. Three and one the count. Strike three crosses, strike two crosses the inside corner, brings up a full count. Foul ball. Foul ball. Ball four puts Benningfield on first base, advancing Gribbins to second. Brings up the shortstop, number one, Kendall Thompson. Now batting for the Lady Knights, number one, Kendall Thompson. Looks like we got a wardrobe malfunction for the Adair County Lady Indians catcher. Had to change gloves here. Mid-frame, we'll see what happens. Stepping into the box, the shortstop, number one, Kendall Thompson. Ball. First pitch is a strike across the inside quarter. Ball one misses high and away. One ball, one strike. To the glove of the second baseman for the out. Leaves two runners stranded after three complete. Lady Knights on top, 7-0.
Going into the top of the fourth. Lady Knights on top, 7-0. First pitch is a strike. Swing and a miss. Bell ball. Strike three. Now batting for the Lady Indians, number 20, Gist. It's going to be a foul ball almost. Out of the fence in foul territory. Hole and count. Ball one misses high. One ball, one strike. Popped up to the catcher, number 16, Grayson Mattingly for the out. Now batting, number one, Two down. West. Foul tipped into Millions Glove for strike one. Another chopper to Grayson Mattingly. The one three put out Mattingly to Caldwell. Ends the top of the fourth. In the top of the fourth, the Lady Indians scored no runs on no hits. Drew up in the bottom of the fourth for the Lady Knights. Atkinson. Stepping into the box, number 11, the senior, Kiera Atkinson. Strike one crosses the inside corner. 0 and 1, the count.
and a hard shot into the glove of the shortstop. Now coming to the plate, number seven, Kendra Gaddy. Kendra Gaddy, the batter. And a hard shot caught by the right fielder. Brings up number four, Chloe Cox. And now batting number four, Chloe Cox. Ball one misses high. 1 0 -oh count in the on deck circle. Number to the leg of the pitcher. As the pitcher makes her way off of the field, we will have a uh, relief pitcher. Prayers for her and her recovery. We got runners on the corners. New pitcher coming in for the Adair County Lady Indians. Now pitching for the Lady Indians, number 17, Keelan Bergen.
Courtesy running for the late nights. Number 10, Chastity Ferris. Courtesy runner four, Caldwell. Number 10, Chastity Ferris. Stepping into the box with two outs in the bottom of the fourth. The pitcher, number 16, Grayson Mattingly in the on deck circle. The catcher, number 20. Uh, scoreboard just went out. Oh, and nine, uh, zero to nine. Lady Knights on top. Million at the plate. Off speed. Crosses the middle of the plate. Oh, and one to count. Ball one, misses high. One ball, one strike. Courtesy runner for the pitcher, number 20, Kenley Craig, assumes second base. One ball, one strike. Ball two, misses high. Two and one to count, two million. Two and one the count. Ball three. Ball two. 
Ball four puts Million on first. Her second walk of the game. One for one with two walks on the game. And now coming to the plate for the Lady Knights, number three, Tori Gribbins. Gribbins, the batter. Two for two with one home run, a three run. Popped up to the pitcher for the out. Leaves Million stranded and another one stranded. Kenley Craig. After four complete, Lady Knights on top, 9-0. <clears throat> Throw down to start the top of the fifth. Lady Knights on top, 9-0. If you'll notice Little in the top of the scoreboard, the there we have Number eight. a radar courtesy of Coach Matthew Schmuck. Did you catch it? We was trying to get the box. You're supposed to catch right, the foul ball. I'm all right, I'm all right, I'm all right. <laughs> foul ball. Strike two. Catches the outside corner. <laughs> oh, and two, the count. Bubba. Oh, and two, the count. Swing and a miss on the wheel, high pitch. Now batting, number five, Cheatham. Oh, goodness. Ball one misses just a bit outside and low. 1 0 count. Ball two misses high. Two and oh the count to Grayson Mattingly. <laughs> Swing and a miss. Two balls, two strikes. Oh, 
Ball three misses just a bit outside of the zone. Unable to collect that ball. Million is a little bit too short for that one. Full count. Ball four puts the runner on first base. Now coming to the plate for the Lady Indians, number 33, Campbell. Double. Strike called across the middle of the plate, owing to the count. Foul ball. Ball one misses just a bit high and outside. One and two, the count. Strike three crosses the outside quarter. Now batting number 11, White. Swing and a miss. Oh, one count. Got her out at first base. Another pickoff by a million. Million to Thompson to Caldwell. I don't know what. Million to Compson. <laughs> one more time. Million to Caldwell. The pickoff at first base. I'll take this opportunity to shout out to United Threads here in Lebanon, Kentucky. For all your sporting apparel needs, go see Jay and Nicole, United Threads. Moving up for the Lady Knights, number 22, Claire Benningfield. Number 22, Claire Benningfield, the batter. A 
shot into the glove of the shortstop. Brings up number one, Kendall Thompson. And now coming to the plate for the Lady Knights, number one, Kendall Thompson. Ball one misses inside. In the on-deck circle, the top of the order, number 11, Kiara Atkinson. Will be a JV game following tonight's matchup. Ball two. Two oh count. Ball three. Strike one called um, <laughs> take a three and one count to Kendall Thompson. <laughs> Swing and a miss. Ball four hops across the plate. Brings up top of the order, number 11, Kiara Atkinson. And now coming to the plate, number 11, Kiara Atkinson. Nice save by Don Caldwell. Saves grandma, great grandma. And another foul ball into the stands. Oh, and two the count. Ball one, the off speed misses just a bit in front of the plate. One ball, two strikes. Two balls, two strikes. In the on-deck circle, left fielder number seven, Kendra Gaddy. Thompson takes second base on the wild pitch. Full count.
Uh oh! And the park home run on the left side for the senior, number 11, right fielder, Kiara Atkinson. A two run shot over the left field fence for number 11, Kiara Atkinson. Her second of the season. The bling bat goes to number 11, Kiara Atkinson. That will be the game, folks. Lady Knights, 10. Lady Indians, zero. And with two runs in the bottom of the fifth, that makes a final score. Lady Knights, 11. Lady Indians, zero. The JV game will follow shortly. Lady Knights take the game 11 to 0 on a walk off two run bomb by number 11, Kiara Atkinson. Folks, we'll be back here in just a minute with the JV game. Stay with me here on the Million Sports Network. 